Clouds have forever held the imagination of sky gazers, who are captivated by their endless beauty and seeming randomness. But clouds and what's in them also hold fascination for scientists who seek to understand the many effects they have on life here on Earth. Low clouds, which are white, can, can reflect sunlight and cause cooling of the Earth. And high clouds tend to warm the Earth by absorbing and re-radiating warmth back into the atmosphere. Two, one, we have ignition and we have liftoff of NASA's Calypso CloudSat spacecraft. Since its launch in April 2006, the Cloud Aerosol LiDAR and Infrared Pathfinder Satellite Observation Mission, Calypso, has provided new insight into the role that clouds play in regulating our climate. As Calypso orbits the Earth, its light detection and ranging, or LIDAR system, emits short pulses of green and infrared light, producing a 300-foot wide snapshot of what's in the atmosphere from top to bottom, clouds and airborne particles. Snapshots collected along the same orbit are then streamed together to paint a picture of what a vertical slice of our atmosphere looks like. It's basically a, a large laser rangefinder and it shoots light down into the atmosphere and it's able to detect and measure clouds in the vertical, not like a photograph, which is, tends to be two-dimensional, but gives us vertical curtains of cloud, measurements of clouds, i.e. their altitude. These critical cloud data from Calypso are used with information gathered by other satellites in NASA's A-Train constellation of Earth-observing spacecraft to quantify just how much sunlight reaches the planet and how much gets radiated back into space. This so-called energy budget is a key to documenting and understanding climate change. We have found it appears as though the, uh, the Earth is warming and, they're warm, and it's warming because of an imbalance or a change in the Earth's energy budget. To see and learn more about Calypso's cloud images or how Calypso is also helping scientists understand how climate may be changed by naturally occurring and man-made particulates in the atmosphere called aerosols, go to www.nasa.gov missions and click on Calypso.